Hello everyone, my name is Aram and welcome you back all again to the YouTube channel after 1.5 years. I know this was a very long time, but yes, finally I'm back on YouTube. अभी तक मैं कहाँ पे था इसकी पूरी हम बातें कर रहे होंगे इस वीडियो में बट इफोर दैट दो डोंट नो मी लेट मी रिड्यूस माई सेल्फ माई नेम इज आर एमन आई एम फ्रॉम दिल्ली एंड राइट आई एम डूइंग बी टेक इन कंप्यूटर साइंस फर्स्ट ईयर फ्रॉम एन आई टी अलाहाबाद तो बिफोर कमिंग बैक ऑन द यूट्यूब आई वॉज थिंकिंग कि किस वीडियो से मुझे कम बैक करना चाहिए आज आई शुभ टूटोरियल वीडियो रिव्यू वीडियो और नॉर्मल अनबॉक्सिंग वीडियो बट दैन आई रियलाइज दट इट्स माई व्यूवर आई टू नो दट अभी वन पॉइंट फाइव ईयर से मैं कहाँ पे था और विच पर्सन लेवल पर आई वॉज फोकसिंग ऑन So then I decided that yes, this video will be all about where I was from the last 1.5 year. Uh, in short, I would like to tell you I was preparing for an exam called JEE that ultimately help you to get admission in top engineering colleges like IITs, NITs, and Triple ITs. And for that, I would like to say a big thanks to my chemistry teacher and computer science teachers whose guidance ultimately helped me to crack both JEE and in advance and to get in such a great engineering college. So, क्या ये पूरी स्टोरी आपको यहाँ खड़े होके बता रहा हूँ या बोल करते हुए? Absolutely not. So let's get on the campus and start up with the story. But before continuing further, I would like to say a big thanks to you because you are the only one that ultimately made this channel to cross 10k subscribers. Like crossing 10k subscriber was a very big milestone for me, and yes, your support did this. Thank you so much for this support. I believe that in future also you will keep supporting this channel as you are doing now. Thank you so much. So let's start up with the story. So let's start from the very beginning. The story starts from class 10th when I was having three options, either to go with science. commerce or arts to be very honest i believe it's a very basic generalization in society that the student who chooses science is good in studies the student who chooses commerce is average in studies and the student who chooses arts is below average but what i believe is when you're not being aware that in which field you want to pursue your future when you're not being aware that this is the field in which i want to become a professional expert then science stream is the best stream to go with Because science stream will never eliminate the options available out there. In fact, it will provide you with more options in which you can pursue your future, right? So yes, believing on this thinking, I chose science in my class 11th. My whole class 11th was spent in Corona time, so I didn't know when class 11th started or finished. But yes, class 11th was the very first time I was properly active on YouTube. I started two series. The first is Hashtag Skate Rock, which has a very good response. And in fact, there are many videos out there named on Hashtag Skate Rock. एंड सेकेंड वॉज स्केट सेटअप वॉर जिसका उतना अच्छा रिस्पॉन्स नहीं मिला जिसका मुझे बाद में रीजन पता चला कि उसका आइडिया बहुत कॉम्प्लेक्स था वी विल भी मॉडिफाइंग द आइडिया फॉर श्योर एंड आई बिलीव उसका भी अच्छा रिस्पॉन्स मिलेगा तो ऐसे करते करते क्लास एलेवेंथ खत्म हो गई एंड इन ट्वेल्थ क्लास आई रियलाइज मेनी ऑफ माई फ्रेंड्स आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर एन एग्जाम कॉल जे ई ई विच एनेबल्स यू टू टेक इन्वेशन इन टॉप इंजीनियरिंग कॉलेजेस लाइक आई आई टीज एन आई टीज ट्रिपल आई टीज ऑन द सजेशन ऑफ माई कजन आई डिसाइड इट ओके आई विल ऑल्सो स्टार्ट प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर जे ई फॉर द इनिशियल मंथ मैं उतना सीरियस नहीं था आई एम नॉट सेंगे बिल्कुल ही सीरियस नहीं था आई वॉज सीरियस बट नॉट दैट मॉज सीरियस विच इज़ रिक्वायर टू क्लियर एनी कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम टू बी वेरी ऑनेस्ट फॉर जी एग्जाम आई वॉज स्टिल मेकिंग द वीडियोज आई स्टिल रिमेम्बर इट वेरी वेल इट वॉज जून टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन वेन एवर चैनल वॉज ऑन स्पीक द रेवेन्यू वॉज ग्रोइंग द रीच ऑफ दिस चैनल वॉज ग्रोइंग वी वर गेटिंग न्यू ब्रांड्स फॉर कोलेब्रेशन बट दैट वॉज अ टाइम माई केमिस्ट्री टीचर सजेस्टेड मी दैट आर एम यू शुड टेक अ ब्रेक फ्रॉम यूट्यूब Because this is not the time when you should focus on your YouTube channel. This is the time when you should focus on yourself to clear a competitive exam. And without questioning myself, I follow her guidance. I decided that yes, I will take a break from YouTube. And 2020 batch know this thing that our two bar board were there. First in December, second in March. And because of this, my J preparation start clashing with my boards. And with the help of my computer science teacher, I realize that computer science is the field which is made for me. In order to pursue computer science in future, I have to do B Tech in computer science, and for that, 
I must have to clear JE exam. And that was the point I realized the reason why I should prepare for JE. By the time I realized that this is the one of the major mistakes that most of the JE experience do, because of which many of the JE experience fail every year, is that they're not being aware that they have to clear JE. And that's the major reason why most of the JE experience fail. After getting the result of my first attempt, I was a little bit demotivated but with the help of my father, I realized the areas, the points where I'm making a mistake. I decided, okay, next attempt, I'm not going to make a mistake. In August, I was having my second attempt. In second attempt was the only attempt in which I cleared J with a very good rank, with a very good percentile. They ultimately helped me to get an admission in an IT ally about computer science. And to be very honest, when I started the J advanced preparation, I didn't miss any of the IIT Bombay CSC to target. My only main motive was to get computer science in any of the best engineering colleges. But my father suggested me, okay, I remember you should like just give a try to J advanced. And to be very honest, I also cleared J advanced. My rank was not high, I think I got a CSC in any of the old IITs. Because of my craze for computer science, I decided to drop the idea of joining IIT. Because after all, CSC was the only main reason why I was preparing for J exam. So here are the few things which I want to list out, which might help some J experience. The first thing is, never prepare for any competitive exam without even realizing that why you have to prepare for that exam. Let's take the analogy of J. If you're preparing for J, then first get the realization why you have to prepare for J. Then start your preparation. Because if you're not being aware that you have to J prepare for J, you have to prepare for J, then after all you will end up in failing. Second thing is, always believe in yourself. While preparing for any competitive exam, you will face many self-doubts, you will face many problems, but always believe in yourself. And third is, never target a particular college. Always try to target a particular branch. Because college is one thing which will stay with you for only 4 years. But branch is the only thing that will stay with you for your whole life. And last but not the least, always believe in yourself while you are preparing for any competitive exam. Always have faith and believe in yourself that yes, you will do that. No matter how the situation is getting worse, no matter how many times you are falling, but always believe in your hard work that yes, the best will happen in the future. So thank you for watching, that is it for today, I hope you liked this video, and yes, I am finally back on YouTube, I will be soon uploading more further videos. Till then, thanks for watching, and don't forget to skate.